what's up y'all it's your girl Sana Amara and I'm back with a new video so today I am going to do a haul I shopped at Nasty Gal and typically I don't shop at Nasty Gal I used to like all the time back in college like probably every week um, <laughs> I definitely had an, an addiction to Nasty Gal um but like ever since they got bought out by boohoo i just wasn't impressed by their clothes like to me nasty gal used to be boho and badass and now it's just like boho and basic so um big brother instagram caught me so there was like this really cute mint green dress that they were advertising and they were saying that it was on sale so i was like let me click on it and see. So, I bought a big old bag of stuff. So let's dig in and see what I got. Let's see, it's like a little tote bag. I have to get scissors for this. Bohemian. I noticed that my style changes like spring summer versus fall winter like during the spring summer I'm pretty like bohemian sometimes I like to throw some like street urban wear in there um but then like in the winter time sometimes I like to wear florals and bohemian stuff but it's mostly like sneakers and like really chic kind of like sporty so I got this dress it's really long and I'm petite so I feel like it might be too long on me oh no it's not bad I can wear heels with it and I'll be good it has these cute like slits which are really nice and show off my legs um but yeah it has a big nice open back super sexy so this dress was 80 and I got it for 40 um, and I'm really excited to pair this up I feel like I could definitely wear this in the fall this is probably a fall outfit for sure fall winter I'd probably pair it with like leather jacket put on some Maybe my tan boots, my thigh high boots. That'd be super chic. Maybe throw a belt, belt it. I don't know. Yeah. Um, I'm not really impressed with the material. It feels super cheap. I feel like I would have to hand wash this just so this wouldn't snag on anything. You can already see that there's some runs in it. But. That's what you get when you buy cheap shit. Um, ah. This dress. Oh, the tag. I know y'all saw that. The tag fell off. I did not pop the tag off. Okay. Um. This is another bohemian dress. I'm really like into lace and ruffles and all that good stuff. So I thought this was perfect for me. It's very like gothic. I love it. Um, honestly, I feel like I could wear this to a funeral without being too extra. I don't know. I'll have to try on and see because I pretty much wear the exact same dress for funerals like all the time so I wanted to switch it up so hopefully this isn't looking too extra um but yeah it's like super deep v-neck I could button it up if I wanted to like if I'm going to a funeral I probably would but oh this is really long yeah I'd have to wear heels with this one too but yeah 
majority of my dresses were super bohemian. I'm realizing that now. But what can I say? I'm a bohemian type of chick. With this, I'd probably wear, like, if I'm not going to a funeral, I'd wear it with, like, um, a wide brim hat, a statement necklace, that'd be really cute, belt it too. We would wear some type of heel, but not one that has, like, embellishments on it, because I feel like it would get snagged on the lace, and I don't want to mess up the dress. Ooh, it has a lining in it. It has a little slip in there. See, and like, none of this shit is by Nasty Gal anymore. Like, it's so weird. Like, who, Danity? Who is Danity? I don't know Danity. This one was originally 120 and I got it for 60 So, I think it's a pretty decent deal. Ah. Ha. <laughs> Another Bohemian dress. So this is actually a two-piece. Oh, wait, this, nope, this is not by Nasty, y'all. Lola May, I don't know who these people are. Um, yeah, so this is a two-piece. Again, super florally. Probably gonna have to wear some type of heel with this, but I might get it him just so I won't have to wear heels. So this is a long skirt. It's got a nice little slit in it. Show off my legs. Um, and then it has this tie up top. It's gonna be super cute. This gives me like Coachella vibes. I feel like I could wear this at like a festival, music, art, anything like that really. I'd wear some burgundy boots, a simple necklace. But layer it maybe this was $70 but I got it for 35 I feel like these are the prices that they should be <laughs> from the get-go versus like this actually being on sale because I feel like the quality of the material is really cheap like it's not that great but what else I'm gonna make it look cute and that's all that matters. <laughs> oh, okay. Not a lot of florals. I'll make it work for the fall too though. Now this top, oh my gosh, this is from Nasty Gal. I'm shocked and it smells Nasty Gal. This top I thought was super cute. I loved all the like little strings hanging off of it. I felt like that made it kind of like sexy looking. Um, it's backwards. <laughs> I think it might be too big on me, but I'll, I'll make it work. I'll probably get it tailored. It had a matching pant, but I already have pants that are pretty similar to this pattern from Zara, but I probably won't wear them together. I might, you never know. I pair this with some black pants, maybe even gray moto jeans. Shoes, mm, I could wear some black booties maybe, or even, oh, I have these really cute rusty colored clogs I could wear these with. This is definitely like a summer top. I think it's cute, I love it. This one was, originally 36 but i got it for 18 bucks and this material seems a little bit better like than the other like brands like i know it's not actual silk but like the sewing isn't done on it either so that's not all that great it's not really it's not a clean finish yeah but i like this top i think it's super cute it's super flirty it's perfect for going out with the girls or even a date night with your boo. Yeah, this is a cute top. Ah, and last, yeah, last but not least, the infamous green dress. This is the one, this is the dress that drew me in to the sale that was going on with Nasty Gal. Oh, 
Oh, and this is part of a Nasty Gal too. Nasty Gal collection. So this is like cowl neck, like freakum dress type. Super cute. I love this color too. I think it'll look really good with my skin tone. Um, but yeah, this, I love this. It's kind of like a slip dress, which is really in right now. So I think I'll be able to do this justice. And it kind of reminded me of that one episode of Sex in the City where Carrie was wearing that nude slip dress to go on a date with Big and I ended up in that weird ass like hole in the wall Chinese spot. Um, and me and my girlfriends, we usually have like a girls night once every month or so. And I feel like this would be a super cute going out dress. I'm really excited to wear it. I'll probably wear it with like some strappy silver heels, maybe a simple silver necklace, a cute blinged out clutch. I think I'm gonna bring this to Vegas with me. I think this would be really cute in Vegas too. Cause I'm gonna go see Drake and the Migos. I'm really excited. And this dress, the mint dress was $50 originally. And I got it for 25 I don't know. It needs to be pressed, too. It's looking kind of wrinkly. Homegirl looking kind of wrinkly. But, um, yeah. This was my haul. If you enjoyed it, make sure to give this a thumbs up. Make sure to subscribe. Follow me on all of my social media. At Anna Smira. Hope to see you guys next time. Bye.